You're spinning me around. My feet are off the ground. All right, guys, welcome back. If you guys are new here, hi, hello. My name is Blake. And if you're not new here, I missed you. How are you? I love you. And welcome back. So today we're gonna be doing a little Abercrombie Spring try-on haul because I got a few new pieces in from them. Actually, I got a lot of new pieces. So we're gonna try to rattle them off pretty quickly. You guys really liked the other spring dresses, but that was more formal slash semi-formal. And these are gonna be more casual dresses, like dresses that you could pretty much wear like on the day today. And I'm starting in one actually right now. I feel like styling this one a little bit more cutesy because, or a little bit more like, I wouldn't say this is edgy, but this dress as a baby doll dress just typically t tends to lean more girly just because of the structure of the dress and also the stripes, I feel like makes it a little girly too, um, instead of it just being like a plain color. This definitely comes in a few other colors. I got this in an extra small petite because I like it to be a little bit smaller, or sorry, shorter. I am 5'1", by the way, and I get all of my dresses in extra small from Abercrombie. Sometimes I get petite, sometimes I don't, just depending on the style of the dress. But something like this, I'll get an extra small petite because I want it to be a little bit shorter. And this is actually a romper. This isn't even a dress, technically, because it has little shorts underneath. So this would be really good if you have kids and you need to be like picking them up and you're running around with them all the time. but you still want to like look pretty cute and not wear just some biker shorts. So this could be really good. It also has pockets as well. And I paired it with a bright bag and then also my cheetah uh, gazelles because I wanted it to be a little bit more fun. Like I like pairing not so common patterns together. So I just feel like this is so cute and it's easy to just like throw this on and literally go anywhere. Okay. I love this one. I know it might not be everyone's cup of tea, but me personally, I have always been obsessed with lemons ever since I was little. My first screening, or not my first one actually, I think it was like my second screening. My second screening was eat a lemon because I would just like eat lemons, like my AOL screening. If you guys are old like me, you'll understand. But I used to just like eat lemons after school. So I just love anything with lemon, lemons. And I really do feel like this specific style dress is very flattering. It's a trapeze dress. And this is a very, very thin. Like if you are a sweater, you get hot easily. This might be the dress for you. I was wearing a dress yesterday to an event and it was almost the exact same thing as this, but it was a linen blend dress instead of this it was kind of like almost like a silk blend. It's very thin. I don't know how else to describe it. And it is double lined by the way, um, but both layers are very thin, but I was so hot in that other one. That one was also from Abercrombie, um, but I was so hot in that one. I'll put a picture here because it's very, very cute as well. It's almost the same thing, but I was sweating so much and I feel like linen, although it's supposed to be like very airy and light, it kind of makes me sweat sometimes. But this one I feel like would be absolutely perfect in the dead of heat. I feel like this would be really cute in Italy too, guys. It's very cute. I just paired it with a pair of Sambas and I am wearing the extra small petite in this one. And I feel like it's just really flattering as well. And there is a lot of space here. If you're pregnant, if you're not, just letting you know. And it does have pockets too, which obviously like that just like gains so many points in my book when something has pockets because usually the purse I'm carrying, it can't carry all my shit. Let's just be honest. So yeah, that is it. I think it's so cute. I hope they come out with like a few, a few more designs because I feel like this one's really, really pretty. If you guys follow me on TikTok or Instagram, you would have seen this dress probably more times than I am proud of because I've been living in this dress. This dress is very similar to the one that I just showed you, the lemon one, but this one is the linen blend material. So um, I just love this so much. It comes in a wheat color like a khaki color, light khaki, and then also a uh, black color, which I tried getting my hands on, but it was sold out before I could get my little fingers to check out. So I have, I'm checking for that because I think that that would be a perfect dress because it's black and my self tanner won't ruin it if it is, you know, if it's a little bit hot outside and I'm sweating, but I love the shape of this dress. I love everything about it. The baby yellow color, it is absolutely perfect in my mind. This is my perfect dress. And again, like if you get bloated or something, like you're not gonna be able to see it in this dress, which I really like. I love the length of this. This is an extra small petite. And yeah, I cannot say enough good things about this. I've linked this so many times. So I'm sorry if you have seen this a million times on my TikTok or on 
my Instagram. But yeah, love this one. 10 out of 10 for me. This is a quintessential Blake vacation look. Honestly, Blake at home look too, but this is literally what I wear on vacation, like whenever we go to Europe all the time. A long, flowy dress is just my go-to. I just feel the most comfortable in something like this. I feel like Abercrombie does a really good job at these types of dresses. I wore one to the ground when I was on my honeymoon last year and it sold out really quickly. It was from Beachy and everyone kept being like, where's it from? Where's it from? I'm like, it's literally sold out, babes. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. So if this one is still in stock, they have this in white as well, which I did order. So I will show you guys that next. Please do not like let it sell out before you get it because it's so stunning. I actually think I might like this one a little bit more just because it has a little bit more detailing. The bottom has like a little ruffle. Throughout here, the tiers, there are little patterns of crochet or knit. I don't know which one, probably knit, I would assume. But yeah, it's really comfortable, not itchy at all. I like the extra little layer right here and it's so stretchy and it also has pockets, which you guys know is my favorite. It's just so flowy and airy and you can definitely wear this all the time. This I got in an extra small regular. Okay guys, so this is the white one. We're not gonna stay here for that long since I did just show you guys in the black, but I feel like black is really hard to pick up on camera, just all the details. So all the frillies and all the ruffles, you can see how stretchy this is. So if you have bigger yiddies, if you have smaller yiddies, I feel like it would be really easy to figure all that out and fit it all in here. Um, again, it has the pockets. I did get this one in the extra small petite. I wore this one with heels, but I wore the other one with sandals. So it looks good with both. Honestly, you can even wear sneakers. It really, this dress is pretty versatile. If you want to wear this for a baby shower, that would also be good. I feel like it does give body because it is like kind of sucking you in right here. So obsessed, love it. Also shameless plug. Um, these sunglasses I designed, so they are gonna be available to purchase soon. If not, by the time this goes up, probably in a week. So if you're seeing this week after we put this up, um, I will put everything in the description box. So very excited. Also those black ones that I was just wearing with the last outfit, those are also part of the club. So, okay, this, this is the wild card for me. Cause usually I don't do stuff like this, but I wanted to try it out especially just for you guys. I'm still on the fence about it for me personally. Um, I just don't know about the length. Is this like, is it, I'm thinking like it's, it's either too short or it's too long. Like I think it either needs to be like this. I did get the extra small, not petite. So if it was petite, I feel like they'd be like one or two inches shorter. So that might be my issue or it's not long enough. This is so cute. I feel like I would definitely wear this in like South of France or Italy. The pattern is not like super in your face, but it's, I like patterns that are like big like this. No, you know what? I kind of like it. <laughs> wow, that really, that really took a long time. I think, you know what I think it is? I think it's the shoes. Also, sorry if you can hear Penelope, she's like growling at me because she wants attention. But I think that it's the shoes that I'm having a difficult time with. I think I'm gonna need to, you know, look in my closet a little bit further and decide what shoes I wanna wear with it. Because when I take the shoes off, I actually like it a lot more. So I'm gonna show it to you guys without the shoes. These shoes are my tried and true, by the way. These are from Lulu's and I have them in black and white because I feel like they go with so many things. It's funny that I'm like saying that as I'm saying that they're not going with this dress but I feel like maybe it's more of like a flat sandal situation. I don't know, but I really do like the, um, the shape of this one. And also the colors just are like very, like very cool. So yeah. And like a helicopter, so good. All right guys, this is actually from last year, but I just checked the website and they still have it available. If you can find this, available in your size, please get it. I have gotten so many compliments on this dress. I've worn it so many times and it's just very, very flattering. The pockets are fake, but I got this like last year, right around when Sophia Richie Grange got married. And I was like, yes, please. I bought it. And then I couldn't even get it in time 
to link it and show you guys because it sold out. So I'm really happy that they brought it back this year. It is stunning. I'm wearing an extra small petite. And I believe that this also comes in other colors, if I'm not mistaken. And it's just giving like old money rich vibes. And sometimes I want to cosplay as that girl. So I love her very much. This is what the back looks like. I'm obsessed. And then since I'm always cold, I wanted to show you guys kind of what another, this might be a little bit too big of a sweater, but just kind of, anyways, I usually do a cardigan over the shoulder, like a knit one. This one is more of like a fuzzy one. So it's looking a little bit too harsh, but this is, you'll get the vibes. And I'm pairing it with a little black bag. And then I did some Banbay sunglasses so I can match the metals. And then the Lulu shoes that I just showed you guys, the white ones, I'm wearing them in the black version. Very comfortable. If you are looking for a little kitten heel and one that's gonna be versatile to go with everything, these ones are perfect. I might still have a code. If I do, it's Blake 20. It's only good on your first purchase though. So make a new email to get the 20% off. You didn't hear that from me though. This one I specifically got because when I went to Europe with Michelle last year, she had this beautiful linen dish dress and I wanted it so bad. Obviously I was like, send me the link right now. Of course it was sold out. So when I saw this one, I was like, wait, that looks so similar. It didn't have the detailing like this one do does, like the little, um, eye no, these aren't eyelid cutouts. I think these are just, these are like laser cutouts. I don't know how to describe them, but anyways, I was like instantly purchased, but on the model, it looked to be like a midi dress. And I definitely wanted it to be longer because that's just like the style that Michelle had that I was like obsessed with. So I did order this one in an extra small tall. I've never ordered a dress in an extra small tall before from Abercrombie or from anywhere really. So just letting you guys know that this is the tall length. And I really like it. I think it's super freaking cute. The shoes that I'm wearing are from Dolce Vita. I love their flats. They are so comfortable. Usually flats, it's like hit or miss with me. Like I have really sensitive feet and I have to, I have to be really careful with the shoes that I wear because I get blisters easily. They like make my feet ache, whatever. But these are so soft and I've never had an issue with them. I also have them in red and I'm thinking about getting them in white. I like the little like strap that they have on them. It makes it like, I don't know, a little cuter. The neckline I feel like is really, really, really pretty. Also this like sweetheart, it gives very feminine and it's very flattering. So, and does this have, if this has pockets, I'm gonna like shit my hands. Okay, no, this one does not have pockets. Whereas the other black one, which I wouldn't even really say that they're that similar, but if you were only getting like one, they do fall into the black maxi dress category together. So they are, I guess a little bit similar. The other one would, I feel like would classify a little bit more boho and this one would classify as like a little bit more like traditional. I don't know if that makes sense, but take that as you want, you know? One other thing that I wanted to say about this dress is this dress tends to run big. I am a 34C. Again, I got the extra small tall and it, this is kind of big on me. So if you have a smaller chest, I would definitely recommend sizing down because I have been kind of like pulling this up a little bit. It does have the rubber right here, which helps make it stick to your body a little bit uh, that a lot of strapless things have, which is very nice. But because the back is stretchy, I think that it just runs a little bit big. So just letting you guys know that one. Okay, I know that I showed this one in my last Abercrombie dress haul. So if you watched that, maybe you can speed forward like a minute, but I just needed to just, I just needed to show it to you guys again. Like this, I cannot wait to wear when we go on our, our like summer trip to Europe. I just feel like it is so stunning. It is just so flattering. I love the sleeve length. They come down almost to the elbow. So if that's an area that you'd like to generally cover up, this is a really great dress for that. The cutouts here are not big, but they're enough to make it look like you're giving waist, which we love that. And then the slit is also high and it's just, ah, oh, everything about this dress is so stunning. I got this in an extra small regular, not petite, not long, and I'm wearing like three inch heels right now. So I just love everything about this dress. I'm gonna shut up, but it's perfect in every way. 
wanted to show you guys this one because I was really excited when I got this in because I feel like a lot of girlies are in their bridal era and this could be a really pretty dress to add to your bridal wardrobe. It has these really pretty white embellishments. I love embellishments that are white versus silver or gold. I just feel like it looks more intentional to be bridal, if that makes sense. But I love this. I got this in an extra small petite. I will say that it is a little bit small in the breast area. So take that information as you will. Um, I am just like a little, it doesn't feel uncomfortable. It's just like, I can, I can tell that it's a little tight. This is the back. It just feels like very well made as well. Like it's slinky in ways that it needs to be, if that makes sense. Like it just feels like the weight of it is like perfect. Like it's not too thin and it's not too thick. And it's just like, it's perfect. Would I want it on in shorter? Maybe, maybe, maybe I would, but like, would I want it to be like that short? Maybe, but I'm also like, I'm also five one. So a lot of things I always have to get hemmed. And that's just my life. And then I just paired it with these little Tony Bianco shoes. They're clear, they go with everything. They're perfect. I will need them. Okay, this actually just got delivered as I was recording. So I'm very happy about that. I was like, John, go steam this. I wanna go show the girlies. So speaking of girlies, um, hello. They look so good. <laughs> they look good in this dress. I was worried because when I was holding it up, I was like, this looks kind of big but it actually fits perfectly. It is very similar to the black column dress with the laser cutouts that I showed a few times ago. And it is the same material. It's just a different shape. If you are more of a person that likes a strap and a V instead of like a sweetheart that has no straps. And this one also kind of, it's more of an A-line, whereas that one was more of a column. Let me see if this, this one have pockets. No, this one does not have pockets. And I got this one in an extra small regular. I did not get the petite. And I really like this one too. It's really, really nice. Everything that Abercrombie has done with their dress shop has been very, very good. And I don't say that lightly. Like you, I feel like I'm normally kind of a hater of things and I can find, I can find things wrong with a lot of things, but they did a really good job revamping their dresses because I, I used to be like, I love Abercrombie, except their dresses, but now I can't even say that. So this is really, really stunning and it fits really well. So these are adjustable. And then again, in the back, it does have the stretchy, which I like that it's not the all the way across. The linen kind of meets it here. I feel like it looks a little bit more refined, a little bit more, just a little bit nicer, but to, like comes together nicely. So yeah, I love this one. I'm definitely gonna keep this one. I'm gonna go frolic in this. Okay guys, I just realized that this is the last dress. So thank you guys so much for making it to the end of this. I always am so appreciative of you guys who watch my YouTube channel, who constantly you know, support and follow me. I love you guys so much. I am gonna do a giveaway in this one just because why not? I love you guys so much and none of this would be possible without any of you. So um, what, I, I'm not sure since I just literally thought about it right now but the description will have the rules. I'm gonna assume that it's just gonna be follow me on here, follow me on Instagram, leave a comment of some sort and leave your Instagram handle so that I can contact you. That's how I'm going to be contacting you. I'm not gonna like put it anywhere else other than DMing you. So if you get a DM from me, that's how you'll know you won. Um, and yeah, I love you guys so much. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I hope that you guys found a dress that you maybe wanna wear somewhere, maybe in Europe, hint, hint. You know, send this to your man, tell him that you have to go to Europe because you bought some pretty dresses from Abercrombie. But anyways, I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.